hello there. Now, <laughs> it's, uh, it's Anne in the background here, and uh, the first lovely person you are looking at at the moment is Karana. And Karana is a, uh, a lovely friend, but also an extraordinary artist. And her art is transformational art. And that's why I'd like to introduce you to Karana today, because she is about, this is about Mindset May, about helping you change yourselves and the thinking around where you're heading and what, you, what you've learned from your past. And Karana's art is all about that. That's what I believe anyway. So would you like to say hello, Karana? Hey, I'm Karana, as you heard. And yeah, my art is transformational. And most people then ask, how is that transformational? And the main thing, um, there's two components. One is the art itself, which always tells a story. Even though in abstract art, it's not a story we might be conscious of. And the other part is the um, the colors. Colors talk to us on a very simple and direct way. We have clear emotions to colors, all of them different. Each of us an individual reaction to certain colors. But um, when we feed back those colors we thrive on to ourselves, we have them in our spaces and around us and have them in our clothes and also in art, they um, remind us of those parts in us we want to transform and focus on and let shine fully into the world. So that's the transformation we can personally receive through colours and art. And, and you actually help people explore their own art ability to you run classes as well in this yeah and I do art lessons um, mainly one-on-one -on -one and help people to express themselves through colors and in other at other times help people to find the colors um, which support them and um, can then of course create artworks which particularly speak to them so they um, these are then called commission artworks Yes, and I've been fortunate enough to be part of one of the, the commission ones with, with the group art and that was quite through that she business experience uh, and even the way in which you can help people discover that themselves but some of the artwork that you've, you've produced is just magnificent <laughs> and uh, it'll be good, you know, if anyone is looking for artwork then uh, Karana is a good person to speak to. But um, is there anything else that we can, seeing its mindset may, is there anything else that our artwork can help us in, in discovering or changing things for ourselves? Yes, definitely. Um, that process would be a little bit what I have talked about before, to choose the colour which supports you at the moment most. I have people with... Um, have, I have normally different, a different range of colours around me, but you can also see there's a certain amount of colours around me at the moment. If there's one which jumps at you, it's, that is the one which supports you most. So most people know it intuitively. And using that colour around you can, say, um, through that, change your mindset. So you um, have maybe a bit more positive attitude, or you have it easier to forgive or let go of the things which have been holding you back or you find it easier to step forward and shine in who you really are. Yeah, that's, uh, so uh, anyway, but uh, how will people find you? Are they find you on the website? Or? Yeah, under Karana Haag on, uh, online, website yeah. and Facebook and Instagram and LinkedIn. Um, there's also my phone number, you can always contact me directly. Um, or via email. Right. And do you do any other things with people in the, in the helping them find themselves a little bit? I do um, big group art creations, so any team which would like to anchor their um, next steps, their next phase, oh, their walking well. forward, businesses, yeah, can be really good big groups, can be good from 10 people onwards, okay. but could be 100 people or 200 people. It's um, all about making visible what we feel is needed and important and also yeah, anchoring our own needs but also the group, um, yeah, the getting together of a group, the potency of 
strengths we have when we're more than one person. And, and helping everyone find something about themselves that they probably didn't realise that they can be a creative, a creative group as well as creative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Normally, most people start with, oh, I don't want to mess this up. I'm not good at art. And then they find that they actually can all contribute. And only because we all contribute, we have a big artwork at the end which speaks of everyone. Yeah, and I think that's one of the reasons, because I have, as I said, been part of what, something similar. And the joy that it brought everybody was amazing. But thank you, Crowder. And You're very uh, welcome, Anne. Thank you. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> Lovely, yeah. See you, bye.